Hello Team Logger users, Lacey Wormington here, and we have a new update to the Team Logger app. This one is regarding team to team sharing. So that means now you have the capability of actually sharing your Team Logger video with another organization, another team in your conference. Let's say you're a junior college and you want to be able to give your players some additional visibility. You can now share that with Division One programs, Division Two programs, whoever uses the Team Logger, you can share that with. So let's take a look at what it actually looks like to do that within the app. It's very simple. So you see here, I have a couple games. Just to note, you also can share your practice footage as well. Um, so you have both options. What we also want to look for to make sure that our video is prepared to share is this black arrow here. So if your arrow is gray, it means you are missing one of the two things that we need to be able to share, which that is going to be your video and your events. So if you just have one or the other, that button's still going to be gray. But if you have both, then now you can share your video. So to do so, we're just going to click this black arrow here. And then now I'm going to have all the teams that I could potentially share it with populate here. So I'm going to use that example of being in junior college and wanting to send this to um, some other colleges maybe within my area. So we'll go to college here and you can select, let's say you wanted to do all of division one. You can do that. Uh, we can narrow it down to, so let's say I'm a junior college in Texas. I want to be able to send this to all of my big 12 schools that are within the state of Texas. So I'm going to choose Baylor, TCU, Texas Tech, Houston, and UT. So now I have all those selected. If we go over here to teams on the right side, I can see my selections that I've chosen. And now I am ready to share that video. Now do remember this can only be shared or really used by another team that also has the team logger. So that's good communication to have between coaches to make sure you're sending it to someone that can actually access your video. But very simple, you select who you want it to go to and you click apply, then it is shared. So once it's fully shared, you can see that black arrow now changed to a green check mark. That means our video shared, we're set to go. In that same manner, you can also have other videos shared with you. So if you're looking for that video, it's gonna be in this tab that now says shared. That's another new tab that you didn't have before. So I haven't had any video shared with me yet, but if I did, it would populate here, looking really exactly the same format as what it does for us when, it go, when we go back to the games tab. So that's how you're going to share and view your shared footage. You can also pull up your shared video or video that was shared with you in your Synergy client app. All you need to do is change your data source to my team all instead of just regular my team. So that is how you're going to use our new sharing permission. And we look forward to seeing how you guys like it.